Because I got high. Because I got high. Because I got high. Welcome back fellow Grand Strategists, my name is Danny Stone and I'm delighted for you to be able to join me today for another episode of Imperator Rome playing as Epirus. So, in the last episode, where to start? Um, the worst came to pass and Maskelon has declared war on me and these backstabbing wankers, which is Thrace, now we had an event which made them like us and they joined the fucking war. How is that possible? Anyway, um, so we have this event, veterans move on, so I gain 1,735 manpower, which I will take, local tax, which I will take, and unrest minus one, which I will take. Now, the major issue here is this stack. Now, I do need to get onto them before, um, so what I'm, bef I need before he gets reinforced, so I'm going to put the uh, unit reorganisation on to get the morale up quickly. I'll change it to phalanx, maybe, or no, skirmishing. Or what do I change it to? Oh no, it's the wrong one because I haven't got them all. I got just just only got the one there. Um, let's detach it to the region. Okay, uh, that's that done. Now I'm gonna. No, I want the army. I just go out there, please. Just go in there because that's just blocking me. I want the army, but of course it won't let me select it. Um, okay, uh, let's uh, merge the selected units. You're going to stay there now, because I don't want you to move. Uh, we're going to put you on... <laughs> Skirmishing seems to be the best tactic. Okay, unit reorganisation is on and done and dusted. Hopefully they're going to join. I probably, should have probably stuck it on unit reorganisation, to be fair. Okay, now... Um, if it would let me take my armies, please. <laughs> oh god, this is really on, getting on my nerves now. Okay, so you go out there, then you. Okay, that's the bug, I think. That's how it works. Well, he's staying in there right now. Let's see if we can win. Now, I have Phyrus, which is 12. Marshal stat. He's got 7. Okay, he's nearly double, right? I have more discipline in my cav, and I have light infantry discipline. Please throw this guy back. Now, he's heavier than me, which means he'll move slower because he's got heavy infantry. Hopefully, I'm going to catch this guy and do some serious damage. Uh, religious advances, okay. Well, that was good. Okay, tactical genius. After success in a number of battles, Phyros has begun to display exceptional ability on the field. I gained tactician, which is nice. He lost double the amount of troops, 5,100 troops. I lost 2,600. He has a lot of manpower, though, so uh, it's going to take a bit of a while. Um, I did gain tactician, which gets my martial up even more, and I get more discipline for my infantry and my archers. So now I'm going to put this on unit reorganisation quickly. Probably try and launch a counter-attack. So we'll take that off now. Try and see if we can launch a counter-attack. See if we can start occupying a few lands and probably get a piece. Probably piece him out at some point. What's the... Uh, he's only got 10 supply limit there. And there's a fort here that's going to stop me from moving any further forward. I suppose I could catch this guy, which I am going to do. Hopefully I'll get there before the, the Thracians reinforce. Um, anyway, deficit off our central situation is woeful. Damn, I'm losing money now. Um, that's bad. Well, at least I got the 20 gold off that event, which is better. So he's drilling, which is stupid. Hopefully I'll be able to smash him quickly. I hope so, anyway. <laughs> please, please, please. Please, please, please. Please, please, please. Okay, so we've automatically captured that, which is nice. Okay, so we joined in the battle there. And, oh, there's some Thracian troops in there as well. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. We're fighting for our lives here. We lose this battle. We've lost. Okay, we are victorious again. Uh, why aren't you joining me, dude? I mean, I would like you to come and join me. <laughs> Okay, 
So that's good. Now hopefully we can start taking some of the land. Super piece. No, doesn't want a super piece just yet. Now he has some men there. Yeah, they're retreating. They're retreating a bit. I can't move any further forward, so I have to take this down. I don't want to order the assault. That would be suicidal. Supply sorties. What does Ferris have? Does he have anything to do with siege? No, he has nothing to do with besieging places. Okay, we have another sun. I'm going to keep my finger on the um, on this pro on this territory over here because if I see him arrive, I'm going to have to leg it. I just hope I can take this out before he comes back. I highly doubt it. Now, I would if this guy joined me. Now, I don't know why he's not joining me. I mean, then it is a defensive wall, so... Uh, he doesn't want a super piece just yet. But I'm going to have to fight this smart anyway. We're going to have to be quite clever about it. Hmm. What is this land here? It's vegetables. Nothing really major. Come on, come on. I don't know what he's going to do when he comes back. I've got a supply shortage. What are we now? 14%. Negative 20 reasons. It's slowly ticking. We might have him slightly on the ropes. <laughs> I'm quite nervous, actually. I'm just trying to really be concentrated and see what I can actually do. Anyway, in good hands, the ongoing war has taken up most of the attention of Basilos Firos as it leads our armies to inevitable victory. I hope it's inevitable. Uh, while Epirus does have bureaucratic momentum, uh, there are many issues that await the hands of the capable hands of a legitimate monarch. In the absence of the Basilos consort, Aristomach has taken on some of his responsibilities. Commendable. So my wife now uh, will attempt to assist the country. Good. I hope she does well. Come on, come on, come on. All right, food shortage. Come on. I don't know what he's doing. I don't know where he is. And I don't like it. Uh, religious observances. Consort Aristomach is a pious woman with great interest in religious matters. Naturally, her first priority was a proposal designed to assuage the vocal priesthood entreaties to address the worrying het Toscopies and auguries their diviners have uncovered. They claim that Zeus and all the gods are displeased with Basilus and the situation which has left Epirus. Without his guidance, the gods themselves must be relied to safeguard the country. The lords of the heavens demand that the word be adhered to, lest they bring calamity down on our heads. So I lose 10 gold, but I gain 10 popularity. But the consort gains 10 popularity, which is not too bad. State religion happiness plus 15%, omen power plus 5%, and the Hierophant gains 10 loyalty, which is nice. And we're not going for the second one because it's all negative apart from the stab. So we'll lose the 10 gold. I can afford to lose that. It's just that little bit of gold. Come on, if I take this fort, it takes control of the lands all around the side. Come on, come on, come on. Or can I take... Oh, I can take that. Let's take Extraordinary Ordnance. Siege ability plus 5%. Might help. Okay, Defender's Desert. That's good. That's good, that's good, that's good. What land is this? Okay, so he was going to attack me. Oh god. There's a lot of troops there. God, this is, <laughs> this is so tense. Right, minus 15%. I've got to take that thought. So he's going to attack me. I think this might be the decisive battle. <laughs> oh god, they're all coming in now. Oh god, what's going to happen? Okay, so they've joined in the battle. I am hurting them a little bit. He's coming in a bit late. He has joined. Jesus Christ, it is so tight. <laughs> oh no, come on, come on, come on. Kill, kill, kill. Come on, where's the dice roll? Oh god, he's reinforcing. 
please. Yes, we are victorious. Jesus Christ, this is so tricky. Okay, no longer with us. I could I be known as a man of inaction. Our people's friend or foe uh, will lord the name of Philos the Conqueror. Uh, we killed more men than he did. We lost 3,252 men in the battle. They lost 5,000 men again. Um, now, I am being attacked again by this army of 10,000. I have sent him back. Now, Philos does have the trait Conqueror now, which Assault Ability plus 10%, Prominence plus 10%, Subject Opinion others plus 5. This guy is a beast. He is such a beast. I'm actually going to grant him a holding. Grant yourself a holding, my dear friend, for that battle. I'll grant you a holding in Ambrika, the biggest place ever. You'll have a holding in there. Now he's attacking me, so I've sent him packing. Now we can probably take some land off him. Now that was probably one of the decisive battles of the war. If we can take this guy down quickly. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, 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 there we go. Boom! Back to where you came from, bitch. <laughs> okay, 35%, come on. We might be able to push. What the hell? How did he get there? Okay, so I'm going to have to... When we take that, I'm going to have to double back. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Please don't be stuck at 42%. Please don't be stuck at 42%, I beg you. Please. I mean, at the, at the moment when I play Imperator, I seem to be stuck on the 42% uh, thing. Come on. Ah, oh, shortage again. Okay, so he's attacked me again this time. Come on, we need to whack him down. Whack him down. Whack him down. Come on. Okay, he's back again. Right, come on, we need to take that and then I need to go and quickly reinforce. Yeah, I need to reinforce back home. So we need to take this, go back, reinforce. Um... Take this, go back, kick shit out of them, reinforce, and then come back and move. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, please. Yes, there we go. Hippata has been won. We've got the siege. Well, are you going to give me that, dude? Because he has that, but I want that land. Okay, so I've got that fort. So that's one. That's a major step in the battle. Hopefully, I will kick this guy. So he's running away. Because he knows I'm coming for him. So I don't know how he's going to get round. Maybe if I go this way. Okay, we can block him. Um, anyway, before that, Scandalous Dominus. While the occasionally rackish and loose tendencies of Neoplatonimus Icidae are well known throughout the upper circles of Pas uh, Pasalon, no one was quite prepared for the appalling slew of allegations levelled him at late. There are growing rumours of terrible indecencies perpetrating on slaves at debauched gatherings honouring Dionysos. Okay, so basically he's having orgies with his slaves. And this guy wanted to rule the kingdom. Yeah, yeah, that makes so much sense. Anyway, and his lewd entourage is a bit and debased their latest acquisitions from the Emporia of Gitana. Okay, so he denies them. So what do I do? So I lose 10 popularity. Um, full and fair investigation. Um, oh, that is cool. So I lose a bit of money though. Um, I gain political influence. Token inquiry, or why waste our time? What do I do? I could get rid of because he, this guy, is a pretender. Let's have a look. I think he's a pretender. He doesn't say. I know he's a pretender. He was in the events earlier on. Hmm. I don't want the monthly family prestige because that's for the end of the game. And that's my family as well. It's the same family as me. Yeah, let's uh, let's 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 research what happens. That disallowed him from any office or anything. So uh, yeah, that that pretty much calms him down. Okay, now run, you bastard. Now I've got you. Come on, if we can take him out quickly. Okay, trial developments. Although there is still much work to be done gathering testimony and exploring the specific crimes, both religious and temporal, that Neo Neoptolemos may have committed preliminary findings point heavily to his guilt. While the investigation is not complete, some suggested that Neoptolemos um, be prematurely detained in order to ensure he does not try to escape justice. Um. Hmm. What do I do? 
Det er altså simpelthen. Skud. Okay, så nu er vi nødt til at tage resten af hans troops her. Jeg håber, vi sender dem packing. Okay, that's them gone. The Olympic Games, who do I send? I'm at war, so I'm not going to send anybody. We'll sit this one out. I'll lose a bit of popularity, but I can't afford to lose anybody at the moment, so... Scandal draws to a close. After several weeks of gathering testimony, it's become clear that even the wildest rumours circulating Passeron hardly scratch the surface of the wickedness perpetrated by Neoptolemos, who has committed unspeakable horrors in the name of Hades. Jesus, so basically he's right, evil bastard. Oh well, countless witnesses have come forward, from household slaves to catamites, a mountain of evidence cannot be dismissed as a mere calumny. Having consulted with the most senior religious and juridical experts, there can be no doubt that Neopolemus is heinously guilty in the eyes of law and Zeus both. Yesterday the high priest joined Neil all baying for his blood. Okay, so what will I do? A ruined reputation of fine will deter a variety of lecherous success. He loses popularity, he loses prime, prime, prominence, um, he loses loyalty. Oh yes, I get a crap load of money from this. I lose, the whole family loses prestige and citizen happiness goes up and slave happiness does, but... Um, well, what can I do otherwise? So, Oh, we get scandalously disgraced. So what happens then? My whole family loses prestige. I get six tyranny. Every member of my family loses 20 loyalty. Hmm. No, I don't want to go that far. We'll ruin his reputation. And we'll get him to pay up. We'll pay a big fine. Okay, so we beat him there. So he's been sent back to where we came from. So he's going there. Hopefully we will take this and we'll march further up. And hopefully we can probably engage some more maybe. So he's running away. Okay, we'll get that back. Then I'll reorganize the army and we'll try and get our... Um, we'll try and uh, replenish. Um, so army reinforcement speed plus 25%. Yeah, we'll definitely do some of that once we've captured this. Does he want to sue for peace just yet? Not yet. He will not yet sue for peace. Okay, now we've got that. He might now sue for peace. Not even, we're negative nine. I don't want to sue for peace just yet. We can win this. I can win this. I'm positive that I can win this. Yeah, I'm pretty positive I can win this. All I need is to reinforce enough and then counterattack. So let's quickly reinforce, because I have a lot of troops here and I need to reinforce them all. He's going to have to try and take this back. So I'm not bothered about that. We'll reinforce. Oh, a white piece is imminent. I could do with that guy joining on me. Um, what I'm going to do, I'm going to reinforce quickly and then we will counterattack with everything we've got. Because then I can get up to the maximum amount of men that I've got, which should be 21,000. Hopefully that's going to go quickly, and then I will counterattack, and we'll try and take out the rest of his troops. Okay, let's move. Or do I wait a little bit? I could wait. How much will I get? Each month, 125 men, 125 men, 100. I could wait one more month. Someone died, okay. Okay, let's go. Now I'm going to try and bring him down. Someone... Oh, uh, I need an Epiproxenos. Who will I put? Um, this guy is not loyal. His family ain't loyal, so I'll put this guy in. So we'll get his family loyalty up. So that's that sorted. Now we're going to try and counterattack now. And push him back from his siege. Hopefully we can do some damage. I wonder if we will win the battle. Since we have the terrain bonus now, what is the terrain? Terrain is mountains. So he gets a minus two 
penalty to their dice roll. And considering that we have a major, major, major general, like he's running away straight away. So, uh, yep, yeah, that explains everything. So that's cool. Now, there's a white piece soon. We need to do something quickly, get more war score. Because I have an opportunity here to take some land off Macedon and really, really ruin them. Okay, now we try and catch them. Right, this is a major battle. Oh, God. I didn't see the 12,000 coming in. Oh, God, there's loads coming in. That's bad. That's really bad. That's really, really, really bad. Um, hmm, I think I need to fall. <laughs> damn, 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 damn. We need to fall back. Okay, 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 okay. Maybe I didn't pull that off as well as I wanted to. Um, it's not much of a problem though. It's fine. I can still re reinforce if I wish. I just if these guys came down, then it would all be better. But he's not coming down, is he? He's being an idiot. Yeah, I probably went too far forward. I shouldn't have attacked. Yeah, that was too greedy. I uh, saw too much then and wanted too much. So uh, you're going to go back here now. We are going to try and reinforce quickly. When's the white piece? It's a couple of years. About a year. A bit more than a year and we get a white piece. Shame, I could have done something a bit better. So he's retreating. I need to replenish quickly. And I could try and launch a counterattack. But do I want to? Minus 30, negative 30 reasons. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. We need to fill up here. We need to fill up the men. Fill up the morale. And then we can march on and see if we can take him on again. Come on, we're nearly up to the full, full amount of morale. They're moving out the way. He has 10,000 in reserve. He doesn't have that much morale. Maybe next month I march. Probably should. End of next month, we march and see if we can actually get get him off that uh, get him off that siege. Okay, now we march. Okay, he's running away. No, he's not. He's going around the side. I could catch him. I have a fair amount of troops. I would have more if this idiot joined me. Now I don't know why he's not joining me. I mean, this is really annoying me. He's an ally, and he should be helping us get there. Now, he should have negative roll. He should have minus two dice roll on that. So, he won't attack me there. I might actually just sit on that. Yeah, I'm just going to sit on it. And we'll see if uh, it does anything. I get there when? On the 3rd of October? He gets there on the 6th. Okay, so I get there before him. So, he is going to attack me on this defensive position. Considering I have Ferus. Come on. That's it. Shove them backwards. There we go. So then the other army is coming on the 20th of October. So that gives me a couple of days to reinforce. Hopefully I can push him back. Come on, come on, come on. That's what the massive general is for. And that's what the discipline's for. Come on. Come on. There we go. That's another good battle. So he's not moving on me. Now I'm going to move forward now. See if we can catch some. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, so that's another amount of troops that have been caught. Boom. Now we now we go. Now we fight. Now we invade. <laughs> come on. How long do I have? Not very long. Not very long at all. We captured an enemy, which is always nice. Right, let's split this in half. Um, that's probably the best thing to do. Uh, let's split in half. See if I can do something here. Okay, the sacking of Pharsalos. Looting be gentle, let the men run freely, or oh, let's just non shell hide. Boom, get the money, let's just loot freely as we wish. How long have we got? Not too long. I could do with... Hmm. We'll wait. I'll wait on that. I'll do it at the end of the war. 
Come on, come on, come on, come on. The more land we get, the better. Oh, they're moving out now, sure. Especially when I do all the work. Come on, come on, come on. Can I actually sue for peace here? Yes, I can. So they seed all that to me. Yeah, well, I want that. Oh, this idiot has kept control of it. Right, come on, come on, come on. More land. Okay, we have another child, but that doesn't really matter. Okay. I am actually getting a lot of slaves out of this, so the longer it goes on, the better it is for us. Okay, we need to be quite careful what happens here. So, okay, we've got 100 days. 100 days. Okay, sacking of Larissa. None shall hide. Boom. We just sack everything and destroy everything in sight. Why doesn't he give that to me? That is like mine. I mean, I would like that map. Please. <laughs> okay, so. What shall I have? Uh, let's just get rid of all these. Um, let's get it all down to zero. I don't want all that yet. So, Seed Province. So they seed that province to me. That'll be nice. And then they seed this, 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 this. Oh my god. <laughs> this is better than I actually thought. Yeah, I'm quite quiet because I did not expect this to happen. Um, how long do I have? I want to keep a very, very close eye on that. I want to milk it for as much as I can fucking milk it for. I mean, <laughs> yep, as much as I can milk it for. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. <laughs> okay, I'll probably take this last one. And then I'll go for the peace treaty. Okay, boom. There we go. That's it. Now, peace treaty. Let's go. So, see the province. Um, oh, let's go back off that. Let's go back on the tree. There we go. Let's sue for peace. So, he gives me that. Yeah, I want all that. Oh, but he won't give me all that. But it'll give me that. Okay, this is interesting, and this is all good. So I think that is going to be the peace treaty. <laughs> Boom. And hopefully, he's accepted our peace offer. There, bam. Look at that. Is that not brilliant? Is that not gorgeous? <laughs> I think it is. I honestly wasn't that confident, like, starting this war, because I thought, shit, here we go. <laughs> here we go. This is the point where I get destroyed. But um, by the looks of it, I think we've done a bloody good job. <laughs> I'm amazed. Um, anyway, now what we need to do is strengthen all our control on these lands. So what I'm going to do here, we're going to get our national tax income up. Because um, aggressive expansion change, that'll go down on its own, eh? Planning on going to war just yet. Um, I think I'm going to get the tax. Oh, we don't need the tax. I've got a lot of money, so we'll go for the aggressive expansion change. Blessing of Zeus. We'll get the aggressive expansion down. A uh, lack of governor up here, so I will put a governor in position. The research points, local citizen output, and local freeman happiness. He seems to be okay. I don't have any really major governments, so we'll put him in. Um, well, governors, he's like not the best governor in the world, but it is okay-ish. Um, the main army, you will all f fall back to the capital. Can I import anything? Nothing just yet. Um, <laughs> I'm pretty amazed on what's happened, to be fair. I can expand the Oracle of Dodona. I might do that in the next episode. But what I do want to do here, though, now this is quite important. I want to have a look at the terrain. That's farmland. Now, this is all farmland here. Now, a fort wouldn't be very useful there. I could do a fort there on the marsh. And their plains. 
That's a mountain. We'll definitely keep that fort there. That blocks him off rather nicely. Um, I don't think I need any more forts. Or should I just put one at Larissa? Just in case. Because it stops him from moving then. Because he can't get past there or there. He can come around here, but even though he won't be able to move because the fort would have his only control over this one. This one. Ferry. Farsalos. So they won't be able to cross. Or yeah, he could come down here actually. But even though he won't be able to move upwards, but he could come round, but that would block him there. Okay, so we'll build a fort in Larissa. That seems to be like a good plan. Build a fort there. Uh, maybe build another fort. I could get two, actually. Yeah, let's up it to two. That makes it a bigger and more powerful fort. <laughs> so that's that done. Um, and I think I might end the episode here. I need to have a look how long it is since I've been recording. Honestly, I have no idea. Um, this episode has completely enthralled me. <laughs> it's just, I had no idea. I did not think that I would get anything out of this. Especially considering the one of the big battles that we lost and we had to come back and reinforce and go and beat him. I mean, that was pretty amazing. <laughs> what, did, what did we get before I leave? Before we end it here, I got some olives, some horses, some vegetables, some wine, some fish, some earthenware. I got a lot of stuff. What province did I get it out of? I got Aetolia and the Sally. Why not? <laughs> that is cool anyway I'm going to end the episode here thank you so much for joining me guys if you enjoyed it please don't hesitate to give it a thumbs up I would really appreciate it and as per usual see you all next time for another episode of Imperator Rome later guys <laughs>